guys welcome back to my channel so for today's video I am going to clean out my closet as you can tell it is a small closet but I have it jam-packed with a bunch of stuff and a lot of the stuff I haven't used in a really long time so for sure I have a lot of stuff in here that I have to get rid of so I am literally just going to take everything out of my closet and I'm just going to get rid of a lot of stuff that I don't use anymore I'm either going to donate it give it away I'm not really too sure right now but I'm just going to take everything out and only put back the stuff that I know 100% that I am going to still use so let's get started so the very first thing that I'm going to do is take all of the clothes that is inside the closet I'm going to take it all out and put it on top of the bed and then I'm going to start doing my selection process so I'm pretty much going to make a pile of the clothes that I definitely know that I want to keep and you'll see it's going to be the one that I start doing right now on the edge of the bed and then I'm also going to make a pile of stuff that I'm kind of not really sure on whether I want to So now I'm done with picking the stuff that I definitely know that I want to keep, making the pile of stuff that I'm not really too sure about, which is this pile right over here next to my pillow. And then on the floor, I do have a pile of stuff that I definitely don't want to keep. So for the pile of stuff that I wasn't really too sure about, I'm actually asking Derek for his help. So I'm asking him if he likes it or not. And then that kind of helps me decide on whether I want to keep it or I want to get rid of it. Now I'm just going to work on this bottom part of the closet and this one has my jeans, skirts, shorts, pants, stuff like that. And this part was actually a lot easier because I only ended up doing two stacks. So I did one of the stuff that I knew I was going to keep and then the stuff that I didn't want to keep, I basically just put it on that pile that was on the floor. So this one was definitely a lot easier and I got it done a lot quicker.
All right, so this is my pile of everything that I'm going to get rid of and then I have all of this that I'm going to start putting back into the closet and then I'll decide on if I'm actually going to keep everything that's here. But I feel like this is such a good, like I feel like this is such a good little pile of stuff that I'm getting rid of. And I'm sorry if you can hear my kids in the background, but they're playing with Derek in the living room. So now I pretty much have all of my clothes organized. I know what I want to keep and what I don't want to keep. So I'm coming back into the closet and now I'm going to organize this little area. So it pretty much has some of my shoes and then some of, well not some of my purses, all of my purses and some of my shoes. And that little shoe organizer, I actually ended up taking that out of the closet and I got rid of all of the shoes that were on there except for one pair. But all the shoes that were in there, I had not used in at least over a year so I just got rid of that I didn't put the shoe organizer back in there and then I also did kind of organize my purse I don't really have that many purses I want to say I probably have like six or seven which is nothing compared to how many purses I had I want to say like five years ago I used to have like 40 purses and I just got to the point where I was like okay I'm not going to do this anymore because it used to be like quantity over quality and I just felt like that was so dumb I had a closet full of purses it was just taking up way too much space so I actually ended up selling a lot of my purses and as you can tell I only have like five or six purses now and I will buy like one purse every two years or something like that and I will make sure that it's a purse that's really good quality and a purse that I actually really really love but I definitely do not buy purses like I used to anymore so right now I'm basically just getting all of the clothes off of my bed and I'm putting it back into the closet you are seeing this part where I'm taking it all off of the bed but then I'm also going to show you when I'm actually putting it inside the closet oh guys I have to take a little breather and I don't know if you noticed when I was actually um, taking the clothes off of the bed, but I was also switching out the hangers. There were some black hangers, white hangers. So I kind of switched out the hangers and organized that. So you will see me putting all the clothes back into the closet now. So I pretty much just put all the clothes into the closet and then I will start organizing it the way that I want it to be in there. Now that my clothes is all in there this is when you guys are going to see me actually start organizing it so to the far left I have all of my long mac
All right, guys, so I am all done. This is what everything looks like. I kind of feel like I still want to go in and reorganize it just a little bit more. I don't know, I kind of feel like I can do a better job, but I hear that the boys outside are getting super fussy and going crazy, so I honestly just need to stop at this point. And then I wasn't even able to get up here for the most part. It honestly is organized up there, but I know that there's like one or two empty boxes, so I will do that at some point. But for right now, this is what the closet looks like. And I am pretty happy with it. I can definitely tell that there's more like empty space. I'm actually able to like slide the hangers, which they were like super stuck together because of how full the closet was. So I know for a fact there's a lot more space now. So that makes me really happy. And then let me show you guys the little bit of mess that's here. So I just have to throw all of this away. I don't know if you guys can hear the boys outside. Nathan is crying. I think Derek is giving Nicholas a shower. So I need to just get out of here already, guys. But this is all the clothes that I'm getting rid of, so I have to put it inside a bag. And if you live here in Miami, Florida, I don't know if you've ever heard of... Um oh my god what is it called i can't think of it right now but i'll put it on here on the screen it's basically a store where you can take your clothes and they'll actually pay you for the ones that they decide to keep and resell at their store so i am going to take it there first and then whatever they don't end up buying from me i will go ahead and take it to goodwill and then yeah so this is everything and i just have to get all of these little hangers and organize them but i am oh yeah and i have this over here too that i don't know if i'm actually going to get rid of the little shoe furniture but i'm definitely getting rid of all the shoes in there because i don't use them at all maybe I might keep these over here but definitely everything else I'm getting rid of but let me just show you one last time what the closet looks like and that's it guys thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoy mama's gotta go because the boys out there are going crazy definitely subscribe if you're not and like this video if you did enjoy it so I'll see you guys in the next one bye